Hey, Paul, uh, do you know what Mozart's favorite fruit is? Banana. Banana. I actually tried two times prior to my hip surgery to qualify for Boston and ended up not finishing those marathons due to injury and pain. Not a lot of people are able to get in. I have a couple running friends that have tried for years just to try to get in and they still haven't gone in. I was born on the Hopi Reservation. It makes me really proud to be at big events like the Boston Marathon because just where I come from, the odds are stacked against us. After I had qualified and did the virtual in 2020, you know, I got an acceptance again for 2021, and I was heading out for a 20-mile uh, run that morning, and uh, about 4.20 in the morning, and I got rear-ended by a drunk driver. I did have some injuries that really set me back, and I wasn't able to continue running the way I needed to, so I wasn't able to go do Boston. So to now think that I'm going to be on that stage and running through those hills in Newton and running down through, through the Wellesley Scream Tunnel, and I get chills thinking about it. This is going to be fun. AB marker. I grew up not running, Step actually, free. or having a lot of trouble. Is that free? Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> Des, nice to meet you. So nice to meet you. <laughs> How was the workout? I'm like shaking right now. So am I. <laughs> I think this might be for you. Oh, jeez. How are you doing there, Des, Justin? Are you kidding me? This is better than the lottery. <laughs> <laughs> this is Des Linden right here. So it's been a wicked hard road. It's been a wicked hard road, yeah. <laughs> when you are hitting that, that really hard time, what do you tell yourself? So I've been running a lot of winter miles, mm -hmm. and I've just been saying nails, which is a super easy word, but it's like, just be tough as nails. Tough as nails, I it. like yeah. that. We have this phrase that I think about, probably that last six miles, it's Nahongvita, and it's like your deep, deep strength yeah. inside you. I'll hear it sometimes if I have family out there and it was like, oh my God, yay. Yeah. <laughs> but it, it just a word sometimes can just really get you through a, another mile. Oh my goodness, these are so light. What's more exciting, the shoes or the bananas or me being here hanging out? All three? Can I say all three? <laughs> yeah, you can say all three. Sure. Take it for a spin? Sure, why not? Don't drop me, man. No, I was trying to, no, don't <laughs> drop me. All right. It's like first 20 with your head and then we say the last six to 10K with your heart. I'm excited for you. I can't wait to follow you on race day and, and cheer for you. How do you celebrate this marathon? It's such a big moment. Do you have like a big iconic thing planned? Is it champagne? Are you popping bottles or like, what are we doing? What are we doing I, right now? Um, once I cross that finish line, I'm hoping there's a beer waiting for me. Well, so here we go. I get to share a beer with Des Linden. Cheers. Cheers. I'm gonna be thinking about this for forever. I am going to take this day with me to that start line and to the finish line. So when things get hard, I know that Des is running it in front of me and that if she can do it, I can do it too.